okay, we know that protein is important. We know that calories are even more important, but what do we actually do with that information? How can we get control of those two things? How can we keep tabs on them? Today, I'm gonna to show you exactly how we're gonna do all that using a nifty little piece of software called Macro Factor. I'm gonna do a tidy little screen recording uh, so that you can actually follow along with the setup and see exactly how to set things up. It is very simple. If you want, you can open this video up on your PC or laptop so you can follow along on mobile. Otherwise, just watch this video. It'll be like seven minutes long and then just uh, go back on mobile and re-go through the setup. It's stupid, stupid simple. Just quickly, a little overview about why Macro Factor and um, also why we're going to be using it. Well, first of all, it's the best and easiest to use calorie tracker available. Not to mention, while I'm not there, if you don't know a lot about nutrition, this is the app that can actually make smart modifications to your diet along the way. Meaning if you're losing weight at a good steady rate, it'll say, great job, keep going. If you're not losing weight and you need to eat fewer calories, it can adjust it for you. So it's kind of a smart like nutrition coach. And I can't do that because I'm not there. So it's going to help you make this all really, really simple. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna start a screen recording on my phone so that you can follow along nice and easily. And we're gonna go through the setup together. It's just gonna take a couple minutes. It's very straightforward. Three, two, one, and here we go. This is the dashboard for Macro Factor. This is an application that you're going to wanna to grab on Google Play Store or Apple Store um, or wherever you get your apps. This app does cost $12 a month, uh, but it is the best dollar for dollar investment that you could possibly get when it comes to losing weight and getting in shape. Um, so what we're gonna do now is I'm gonna talk you through the setup. I'm gonna show you how this stuff all works. What you wanna do first is it's gonna ask you just to sign in. So it's gonna ask you how you wanna sign in. I'm going to go with Google here, uh, but you can do however you want. I'm just gonna select this account. Okay, it's gonna say, do you wanna learn? Did you learn about us from an affiliate? Click yes. I can't click yes because it knows that I'm an affiliate. Uh, but if you click yes, then it'll give you an extra two weeks for free. I'm going to go month to month. Okay. Subscribe and start trial. Oh, it says I already have a month. Let me try this. Yep. Okay. Begin with the basics. At this point, once you've got the payment stuff squared away, it's just going to ask you for some really basic information as far as like, you know, how much you weigh and your birthday and all that stuff. Okay, first it wants to know my steps and I'm just gonna skip that. It wants to know my sex, my birthday. Let's just say it's here. Okay, my height, let's just say 5'9". Yep, 250 pounds, that's me. Okay, here's the body fat level estimate. Don't spend too much time on this. Just look at the one you think might be you and just click it. It doesn't matter too much and ultimately, yeah, it doesn't play a lot in the end game. So like that, let it know how often you're exercising, whether this is like, you know, playing pickup basketball or lifting weights or whatever. Let it know how many steps roughly you do each day. If you don't know, just go, yeah, I mostly sit at a desk and I don't do a lot of cardio. If that's you, you can do more. I've been lifting for a year. It'll spit a target at you. Don't worry too much if it's not what you think it should be. Just click not sure if you're not sure. And here's basically what's gonna happen next is as you eat, and track your calories and track your weigh-in data over the next couple of weeks, it's gonna make smart adjustments based on the progress that you're making, which is what makes this app so cool. Okay, I accept the health disclaimer, go to my goal setup. You're gonna click maintain. This is very important. What we're gonna do for the first seven days is we're not gonna diet for fat loss. I just want you to track your calories. No dieting because learning to track is a skill and it comes with its own stressors and things that come along with it. And I'd like to kind of separate that for you at least for a week and then we'll dive into a fat loss diet. So just click maintain, go next. Tell it you wanna have a balanced diet. Just standard floor, this is just asking about your preferences. Tell it that you're gonna be doing some lifting and just go distribute evenly instead of you know doing different calories on different days. That's what it's asking. Preferred protein, just put moderate and it'll set up your protein goals as perfect. And now it's basically just, look at that. Boom, it says 2,850 calories is my maintenance and there's my protein goal. Cool. So that's just kind of an overview of what it set my maintenance goals at. So after this now, we can just go and here is the dashboard. And this is basically just where we see everything at a glance. That is all you need to know on Macro Factor right now. You just need to complete the app setup. You need to use the code for the extra week. You need to start a maintenance diet for the standard floor. Don't shift the calories around. Just do everything standard issue and click maintenance. 
And if you want to bump your protein goal up, you totally can. But honestly, I wouldn't recommend it at this point. If you want to, I'm just going to show this on the screen again. I'm going to go back. You can click strategy and then you can click new program, collaborative design program. And then you go here Monday, Monday's protein, and you can bump it up to 0.7 or 0.8, whatever you want. Tuesday, you got to do the same thing. And then you click save at the bottom, start program, and it'll go from there. I'm not going to do that so I don't mess with it, uh, but that's how you do it if you do want to just, you know, customize your protein goal. But I honestly recommend that you just stick with what you have for today and you just set it at maintenance. Standard issue, nothing fancy. That took five minutes to set up. It'll take you even less because you won't have to talk through it like I do. Uh, and in tomorrow's video, well, the next video, I'm going to show you how we can actually start tracking the calories and how to keep tabs on how much you're eating accurately in Macrofactor so that it can start giving you um, updated goals and, and start helping you lose weight 